all of it. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. As we're about to start our praise and worship, I'm going to ask everyone to please stand as we get in the mood of worship. Around for me. Around for me. Around for me, it's turning around for me. Around for me, around for me, around for me, it's turning around for me, around for me. Around for me, around for me, around for me, it's turning around, around for me, 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 it's turning around. See the breaking of day. God is making a way. A change is coming for me. If I stand strong and believe, there's no reason to doubt. I know He's working it out. Around for me. Around for me, around for me, around for me, around for me, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's turning around, around for me, around, around for me, around, yes, around for me, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's turning around, around for me, yeah, yeah, yes, around for me, around for me, yeah, 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 yeah. It's turning around for me. I can see, I can see the breaking of day. God is breaking away. A change, a change is coming for me. If I stand strong, if I stay strong and there is no reason. Around for me, 
around for me, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's turning around one last time around for me. Around for me, yeah. Around for me, yeah, yeah. It's turning, turning around for me. Lord, prepare me to be a sanctuary, pure and holy, tried and true, with thanksgiving, I'll be a living sanctuary. To be a sanctuary, pure and holy, tried and tried and and with thanksgiving, yeah, yeah, I'll be a sanctuary for for you, yes, yes. Sing, Lord, prepare. To be a sanctuary, pure and holy, holy, tried and true. With thanks, with thanks, give. I'll be a sanctuary for you, boy. Oh Lord, prepare me, yes. Oh, 
on, somebody worship God. Come on, somebody lift your hands and worship God. Come on, somebody lift your hands and worship. Oh, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Oh, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? I said, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Won't, won't it be a time? Hallelujah. I said, won't it be a time? Oh, when we get over yonder. Oh, won't it be a time? When we get over yonder, oh, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Won't, won't it be a time? Oh, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Oh, won't it be a When we get over yonder, won't it be a time? Won't it be a time? Won't it be a time? When we we get over yonder, won't it be a time? When we when we yonder, yes, won't be a time when we get over yonder. Yes, won't it, won't it, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? When we get over yonder, oh, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Won't it be a time? Yes, won't it, won't it, won't it? Oh yes, yes, won't it be a time when we get over Oh, won't it, won't it be a time when we get over Won't, won't it be a time? Won't it be a time? Won't it be a time when we get over yonder? When we get over yonder, oh, won't it be a time when we when we get over yonder? Won't it be a time? Yes, won't it be a time? Won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Won't, won't it be a time? Oh yes, yes, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Oh, won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Won't it be a time when we get over yonder? Yet on the glory road, heaven is now in view. Although the road is rough but time, Jesus will carry me through, carry me by the hand. Oh, get on the glory, get on the glory. Yes, yes, yes,
yes, keep moving up, moving up, moving up. Oh, no. Don't you know that I'm moving up the things I I'm moving up the things I Don't you know that I'm trusting in amazing ways? Oh, yes, I'm trusting in amazing ways. Oh, yes, cause Satan is on my track. Oh, I will never. Oh, yes, keep moving up, moving up, moving up. Oh, no. Oh, when I never, 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 yes, yes, keep moving. Oh, Lord. I know, yes, Satan is on my track. Oh, when I never, never, never turn back. Oh, keep moving up, moving up, moving up. Oh, Lord. Don't you know that Satan is on my track? Oh, what? never, never, never turn back. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Jesus. First, I must greet God, who is the head of my life and my soon coming king. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Then to our bishop, Bishop O.D. Malcolm, First Lady Malcolm, all the missionaries, saints of God, accept all the greeting in the precious name of Jesus. I must greet all those who are viewing on all the different platforms. Accept all the greeting in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Our opening song will be taken from our worshiping songbook. And the number is 189. He brought me out of the miry clay. Praise the Lord. I'll ask the praise team to assist. My heart was distressed me, the overstrength from, and low in the pit where my sins dragged me down, I cried.
will take us to the throne of grace praise the lord jesus let us all pray father eternal god most loving jesus we honor you god we glorify your name mighty god we bless you god lord there is none above you father there is no god like the great jehovah and so father we come before your presence today mighty god to lift up and adore your name jesus knowing that you are god the heart and the finisher of our faith father Father, I pray, God Almighty, that Lord God, as you sit on your throne, God, and you look in low, mighty God. But Father, I pray, God, that you may let your Holy Spirit come among your people today, Father. Lord, I pray, God, for whatever plan of the adversary, mighty God. I pray that you may bind it on our feet, Jesus. Lord, I pray, God, that you may give us the power, God, unctionize us, God, to function in whatever capacity, God, you place us in, mighty God. Father, I ask you, God, and let your grace be among your people today, God. Lord, I pray that you may strengthen, mighty God, your people. Let somebody know, God, that they're coming to your presence with thanksgiving and into your cause with praise, God. You say we be thankful unto you and bless your name father god i pray lord let the power of the holy spirit rise up in this room god and take power in this room mighty god father i pray god almighty for your people lord let a worship experience be felt in this room today god let the power of pentecost reveal itself one more time father break down every yoke of bondage cast out all fears of our heart god let the power let your pentecost of power lord rise up in this room god let somebody cry out i'm healed i'm healed i cannot hold it any longer father i ask you god by the power of almighty god rise up lord i worship in this room today god destroy the yoke of bondage destroy the plan of the adversary destroy lord those god almighty that wish to see the minister oh god the minister fall but father let your grace let your grace be among your people 
Father, I put the moderator before your presence. God, let the moderator know who that she is. Call, Lord, in a time like this, God, to lead the service through the power of the Holy Ghost. I praise God, the one that is coming to bring forth the bread of life. I pray that you may unctionize him to function. Let the power of the Holy Ghost, God, fall upon him, Father. Send the word from home, God. Not his word, but thy word, oh Lord, am I hid in my heart, Jesus. Grant us according to your will. Let your grace be among us in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Our, praise the Lord. Our scripture reading will be taken from 2 Samuel 9, reading from 1 to 7. And I'll ask Sister Candice Ulrich to do the reading for us. Shall we worship the Lord? Shall we worship the Lord? As I was called upon to do the, the scripture reading, I'll do so in Jesus' name. The scripture reading is taken from Second um, Samuel 9, from 1 to 7. And we'll read alternately. And David said, is there yet any that is left of the house of Saul that I may show him kindness for Jonathan's sake? And the king said, Is there not yet? any of the house of Saul, that I may shew the kindness of God unto him. And Ziba said unto the king, Jonathan hath yet a son, which is lame on his feet. Then King David sent and spoke fetched him out of the house of Mashir, the son of Amil, from Lodibar. Seven son appointed, and David said unto him, Fear not, for I will surely shew thee kindness for Jonathan's father's sake, and will restore thee all the land of Saul, father, thy father, and thou shalt eat thy eat bread at my table continually. Herein is a portion of God's holy word we honor thy saying. Bless the Lord. Thanks, Sister Candice Ulrich, for the reading of God's word. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise. We'll all repeat the decalogue. And spake all these words, saying, I am the Lord thy God, which have brought thee out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage. Thou shalt have no other gods before me. Thou shalt not make unto thee any gravely image, or any likeness of anything that is in heaven, or the water in Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them that serve them. I am the Lord thy God, the jealous, the sinner, of the father and to children, and to the third and fourth generation of them that eat you, and short mercy to thousands of them that love me and keep my commandment. Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord thy God in vain, for the Lord will not hold thee guiltless that taketh his name in vain. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. Six days shalt thou labor and do all thy work. But the seventh day is the Sabbath of the Lord thy God. In it thou shalt not do any work. Thou son, nor thy daughter, nor thy manservant, nor thy maidservant, nor thy stranger, nor thy cat. For on the sixth day the Lord made the heaven and the earth, the sea and all that therein, and rested on the seventh day. Wherefore the Lord blessed the Sabbath day and all of it. 
And that thy father and thy mother, that thy days may be long upon the land which the Lord thy God give thee. How shall I kill? Thou shalt not commit adultery. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shalt not be a false witness against thy neighbors. Thou shalt not covet thy neighbor's house. Thou shalt not covet thy neighbor's wife. Nor is man's servant, nor is maid servant, nor is ox, nor is ass, nor anything that is thy neighbor. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Jesus. Praise the Lord. Our welcome will be done by Sister Ingram. Let's worship the name of Jesus. Let's worship the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise God. As I'm called upon to do the welcome, I'll do so in Jesus' name. This morning, we don't have any first-time visitors, but we have two visitors with us this morning. And we have our viewers online. Some might be watching for the first time second or third time so you're considered visitors so this morning i'll just like to ask these two ladies to stand and give me their name welcome sister nelson the lady in the black and white dress can you just stand and give me a name please Welcome, Tamika. You're welcome. I just have a little reading I'd like to leave with you this morning. It's not even a reading. It's a song by George Bantan. And I think someone would like to hear this. Uh, it says, the first verse said, You know, a long time ago, I heard a story about a little old lady. She was standing at the side of the street. In her hand, she held on to a picture of Jesus, trying to show the world what you think about the soon coming king. Then came a young man. He took the picture away from her, and he threw it on the ground. And ho, oh, oh, that lady, she began to smile. She said, son, I have something that I would like you to know. You see, I have Jesus somewhere in my heart. And I just want, and you won't be able to take him there. And the chorus says, help me, Brother Shamar. I've got Jesus, and you can't take him away from me. Once you have Christ Jesus with you, buried deep down in your heart, ain't no one can take him. Just continue to hold on to the Christ Jesus, the one that we serve, the one that we love. And at the end, you'll see what he will have to do for you. 
on behalf of my bishop, First Lady Malcolm, my ministers, deacons, missionaries, evangelists, just continue to watch and continue to stay strong and hold on to Christ. Welcome in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Jesus. Thanking Sister Ingram for that wonderful welcome. I've got Jesus and you can't take him away from me. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Jesus. I've got Jesus and you can't take him away from me. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. I've got Jesus, and you can't take him away from me. Praise the Lord. It's time for our, our tithes and offering. And Brother Ward, Minister Ward will pray for the tithes and offering. Sorry. <laughs> Praise God. Let us all stand. Amen. Praise the Lord Jesus. Father, eternal God, most loving Jesus, we thank you, mighty God. We thank you for your goodness and your mercy. We thank you, mighty God, for your grace that is keeping us alive, Father. Father, I pray, God, for this tithes and offering that's about to be collected, Father. I pray, God Almighty, that you may bless those who have to give and those who have not to give, Father. Lord, I pray you may cause a blessing of Abraham to rest upon your people, Father. Blessing when thou goes out and blessing when thou comest in, Father. Bless, I pray. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, everyone. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Come on, church. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. of the Lord is within me and he's calling me to the heavenly to be to be seated in heavenly places just like heaven just like heaven, just like heaven on earth to, to be walking in favor and grace just like, just like heaven just like heaven In the spirit of unity to our community show his ability the will of the Lord for his children is to demonstrate to, to be seated in heavenly places just, just like heaven just like heaven on earth Lord, in unity, to come in 
ability so is ability the will of the lord for his children is to them on
Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise Him. It's now time for the word. And to give us the word is our own minister, Minister Christie. The man that gave us several words. For example, my victory is coming. I am here because I have life because of the blood. I am not drunken. It's the power of the blood. He will make a way. We come this far by faith. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Jesus. Praise the Lord. Church. Let us stand and accept Minister Christie in care of the Holy We have come this far by day. Somebody open your mouth and release the worship unto God. My God, the church is silent. Come on, somebody open your mouth and release the worship unto God. Come on, somebody lift up holy hands and shout to God with a voice of triumph. Come on, somebody better use your weapon. Come on, somebody praise God. From morning until now, come on, we have been observing formalities. Now it's time to put aside the formalities. Now it's just time to open your mouth, lift your hands, and just give God the worship. Come on, somebody shout. I want to bless the Lord at all times. Come on, somebody praise Him. Somebody help me. Joyful noise unto the Lord. Come on, somebody praise Him. Somebody shout the hallelujah. Come on, somebody shout the hallelujah. I'm not gonna preach in this atmosphere. Come on, somebody praise God. Come on, somebody open up your mouth. I don't know what you came here to do, but I came to worship God. You better open up your spirit. Open up your mouth. Shout the worship. Let the devil drop. We are here to worship God. We drive out every demon, every lukewarm spirit, every spirit of sabotage. We drive it out now. Let the worship be known. Somebody open up your mouth. Come on, I'm not here in the church. I'm not here in the church. Come on, church, we need to have a sound. We need to have a sound. I need to find some true worshipers. I need to find some true praises. I'm going to the word, but I need some worshipers. Come on, nothing will leave heaven until something will leave heaven. So I don't know what kind of stuff you're going through, but if, you, if, I, if you were like me, if I were like you, I would have opened my mouth and given the God a worship. The devil's trying to kill me. He's trying to hold me down. He's trying to depress. 
your mouth my god I, I don't know what's going on here this morning but come on the last time I checked this is the Holy Ghost Church come on we were baptized in Jesus name we were filled with the Holy Ghost and fire come on somebody you better get out of your state and give your God a worship you better see a cough you see a cough and give God a worship you better put aside you put aside and give God a worship give your God a worship I'm still waiting for a sound minister when I'm waiting for a sound I'm just trying to help somebody the church must have a sound the church must have a sound when demons hear that sound come on don't leave me musician when demons hear that sound when the devil hear that sound he have not a church but a back up and back off because he recognized that I am not just by myself but I am home. Dangerous somebody better worship God in this house. Mm. Yeah, glory. And so I give God praise. You may be seated if you can. <laughs> Uh, God, I give him worship, I give him praise. I give him worship, I give him praise. I'm still searching for the worshipers. I, I, I give him worship and I give him praise. I give him worship and I give him praise. Because he has done marvelous things. And I am grateful. I greet the spirit of Christ who is the head of my life. And my soon coming king. Secondly to my spiritual parents, Bishop Otis Malcolm and Lady Malcolm. To all our evangelists, to our dear minister Ward. To our deacon, deacon Knight and deacon Reed. To all the missionaries, to all our saints, to all our visiting friends. Those who are viewing live on our social media platform. My beautiful wife, just about everybody, I, I give you greetings. 
in the name of the one God. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God. My God, the church ain't talking back to me. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one God. And so we give him the glory and the honor. My God, I ask God to give me strength. This one feel rough, Minister Ward. Mighty God of Daniel. But with God in the vessel. My God, my God, my God. I'm going to dig in that bucket this morning. If God in the vessel. I will smile at every storm. The scripture reading was already read. But to had clarity. And to add to what the Lord has laid on my heart to bless the body of Christ. I want you to turn your Bibles with me to Luke, St. Luke 2 and verse 52. St. Luke 2 and verse 52. St. Luke 2. That's St. Luke chapter 2 and verse 52. And I'll be reading in your hearing. Before I even read my theme on this morning, my theme on today is you are highly favored. All right, nobody ain't saying anything to me. You are highly favored. Personalize now. I am highly favored. I am highly favored. Uh, hallelujah. You're welcome, minister. St. Luke chapter 2. And verse 52, my God, somebody better pray my strength up in here. Mighty God of Daniel. Verse 52, and it read, and Jesus increased in wisdom and statue and in favor with God and man. All right, turn over to, turn over with me to. Second Samuel 9, and I'll read just verse 1. Second Samuel 9 and verse 1. And David said, Is there yet any that is left of the house of Saul that I may shew him kindness for Jonathan's sake? And I'm jumping back to St. Luke. Just bear with me. We're going to preach in a while. St. Luke 1. St. Luke 1 and verse 28. St. Luke 1 and verse 28. And the angel came in unto her and said, Hail thou that art highly favored. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. That was a portion of God's holy word. We honor it by saying, thanks be to God. Father, we bless you. We honor you. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for your, your anointing that you have laid upon my heart. I thank you for your anointing that you have laid upon my life. That I may be able to avail myself to be used by you consecrate me now to thy service I am unworthy, I am undone but your grace and mercy has given me this grand opportunity to come into your house to, to break the bread of life to your people, fix me you know how, give somebody a receptive heart to receive this word in Jesus name, amen and amen you are highly favored or let me put it the other way I am highly favored I am not independent of your support and so I am cr craving your support this morning bless the name of the Lord Jesus you are highly favored 2 Samuel 9 and verse 1 one to seven, as I said, it was read by our dear sister Candice Woolery. And it's a very simple bit of reading, but very profound. And so this theme that I'm bringing to the church, it is not a strange theme. 
but it's, it's a theme that you are accustomed with. Amen. 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 I've heard people saying these words lots of times when greeting each other. Most of us even say it without realizing the power behind the words. What does it mean to be highly favored? Favor is defined as approval. A kindly helpful act beyond what you deserve or what you expect. Are you with me? Are you with me? Remember the story of David and Mephubesheth. In 2 Samuel 9 and verse 1, the Bible says, David hacks, is there anyone still left of the house of Saul to whom I can show kindness for Jonathan's sake? To be highly favored means an uncommon and unusual and an unexpected blessing will pursue and locate you are you with me when you are highly favored you will have supernatural increase and promotions are you with me church of god be honored in the midst of your adversities be recognized even when you seem the least likely to receive it. Re receive prominence and, uh, and preferential treatment. Cause rules and regulation laws and uh, policies to be changed and re received and reversed to your advantage. Are you with me? To be singled out for honor be remembered for good we have read about how Mordecai how sorry we have read about how Mordecai and Esther were highly favored in the Bible, even our Lord Jesus Christ was highly favored as recorded in the book of Luke 2 and verse 52. If we have ever felt like a failure in life or felt as if you've lost the grip on the most important things in your life, you need a divine faith favor are you with me if you feel if you feel nothing nothing works for you or feel you are plunged with bad luck or it seems you are unattractive and never loved by anyone I have a good news for you after hearing this message you will be highly favored and you will experience a dynamic turn around for the best in your life in the name of the Lord Jesus beloved to be highly favored we need to first unlock the doors of divine favor I'm going to say it again Beloved, to be highly favored, we need to first unlock the doors of divine favor. We can do so by changing our thinking. Are you with me? Come on, you better talk back to me. We can do so by changing our thinking, expecting favor, sowing the seed of favor, declaring, declaring favor. Building trust in God. I don't care what the devil told you. But I come to decree, to declare over your life today. That, I, that an 
uncommon, unusual, and unexpected favor shall pursue and locate you in the name of the Lord Jesus. I don't think somebody does hear me just now. I said, I don't care what the devil told you. I don't care what the adversary have been telling you. But I come to declare over your life on today that an uncommon favor, an unusual favor, an expected favor shall pursue and locate you in the name of the Lord Jesus. I come to tell somebody that the Lord is about to locate you like he located Mary in St. Luke 1 and verse 28 and the angels came in unto her and said hail thou that are highly favored the Lord is with thee blessed among the woman the word hail means to rejoice it means to be happy I'm not talking about the hell you have been through but I'm talking about it's a hell the angel said hail Mary I stopped by to tell you I stopped by to tell you Stop your worrying and begin to rejoice. I wish somebody would hear me. I said, I stop by to tell the body of Christ. Stop your worrying. Stop your worrying and begin to rejoice. That son giving you problem. That daughter is giving you problem. And you're saying, God, I have worshipped you. I have praised you. I do my best. I pray for the boy, I pray for the girl, but yet still, that child seems to be going off, to be going backward, that child seems to be drifting from the presence of the Lord, but can I tell you, just be patient, just be patient, the it is not yours, but it's the Lord. Stop your worrying and just rejoice. Just declare out of your mouth. Psalm 34. I will bless the Lord. Somebody better help me. I will bless the Lord at all times. And his praises shall continually be in my mouth. My soul, my soul shall make a boast in the Lord. The humble shall hear me rather and be glad. Oh, magnify the Lord with me. And let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord and he heard me and delivered me from all my fears. They looked unto him and were lightened and their faces were not the same. The poor man cried, the poor man cried and the Lord heard him and saved him out of all his trouble. Like Mary, you're about 
order to receive visitation. Are you hearing me? You're about to receive a visitation like Mary because you're blessed. And somebody to say something. I said, You're blessed. Come on, somebody open your mouth and say something. I said, You are blessed. You are blessed. Wake in the morning. I am blessed. I lay my head to rest. I am blessed in the midnight hour. I am blessed. I am blessed in the holy favor. And it'll come. And it'll come with a complicated message. I came with a few simple words. I came to tell somebody that I got the church of God today. Although you don't see see the way, though you don't see the way, the way has already been made, I said though you can't see your way out, that way is already been made, I come to tell the body of Christ, I come to tell the body of, of it, the church is not talking to me, I come to tell some that may be sick in the body because God said I am favored because God said you are favored can I break this news to you you are already healed you are already healed Isaiah 53 and verse 5 but he was wounded for my transgression he was bruised for our iniquity, the chastisement of our peace was upon him, and with his stripes we are healed. I wish I find some Holy Ghost believers, some Holy Ghost believers, some tongue talking believers, some Holy Ghost born again believers who can agree with me and declare. I've been to a hell, but I'm favored. I've been to the darkness, but I'm favored. I have man problem, woman problem, but I'm still here because I am, because I am favored. You make a lose to let me preach because I am favored by living God. I really don't know what the devil is bringing you to, but I come. You are favored. I come to tell you, you are blessed and highly favored. Look at somebody and say, neighbor, if you're looking for a blessing, you don't have to look no further. If you're looking for a blessing, you don't have to look no further. If you're looking for a blessing, you don't have to look no further. You don't have to look no further. If you're looking for somebody that got favor of God, you don't have to look no further. Because my first name is Bliss. And will somebody hear me? My first name is Bliss. And my last name is Favored. And my middle name is Highly. I could to tell somebody, I am blessed. I am blessed. And highly favored. Devil, do what you want to do. Say what you want to say. Drop the devil. When I say favored, I don't mean a car. When I say favored, I don't mean money. But favor mean that wherever I am, God is with me. I said favor mean wherever I am, God is with me. So if I'm God is with me if I'm on the mountain God is with me if I'm down in the lowest head God is with me 
sister but whatever I'm going through God is with me he declared he said surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and I will dwell and bless in the house in the field, I'm blessing the water, I'm blessing the flood, I'm blessing the fire, I'm blessed, and I'm with my God. Somebody open your mouth and be a better worshiper. Somebody open your mouth and declare, yeah, he's a machine, he's a heard. I am blessed, I'm not I am blessed. I am blessed. Blessed on the job. Blessed in the church. Blessed in the workplace. Blessed in my home. I wish to God somebody would just help me. I am blessed and daily favored. Psalms 116 and verse 12. What shall I render unto the Lord for all? Towards me, I am blessed. I know you're blessed. I know you're blessed. Missionary, I know you're blessed. Minister, Ward, you're blessed. You're blessed. You're blessed, 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 blessed. You're blessed and highly favored. You're blessed. My enemies can't stop this. Your enemies can't stop. Your enemies can't block this because I'm favored. I'm favored. I'm favored. Who's report? Do you believe? Yeah, I believe the report of the Lord Jesus. Minister Reed, keep on Reed. Your blesser, Minister Grant. Your blesser.
that she might demise but God I want to love it because I am blessed and highly favored I really don't know who I put you to but the devil lick you down you bounce right back you're a hard man for dead because you're favored they send the derricks they send the iniquity they send all kind of blue but you are favored I told you the last time I preached and I love to say it the devil can't kill what God has anointed to live but I will live again live, 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 live live again I am favored I am favored the blessed of the Lord make it richer and I have fear make it richer and I have no sorrow I am favored let the talk let the criticize let the persecute let the do what they want to do for I am I am about everybody here I am favored I am favored I am favored I am favored your favor your favor your favor ain't no stopping ain't no backing down ain't no backing down I will not waver I will not backslide I will not waver I will not backslide I am solid as a rock for my hope is built on nothing less than Jesus blood and his righteousness I dare not trust a sweet afraid but only lean on Jesus name on Christ the solid rock I stand hard on the ground I come to tell somebody I see I see I see the size of a hand stretching out from heaven he's getting ready to bless you he's getting ready to bless you be patient be patient be patient be patient some trust in the horses some trust in chariots but we will but we will remember the name of the Lord Jesus I don't know who I'm talking to but I don't have to ask you because I know and I'm favored I'm favored I'm favored I'm walking in line with the word of God can I remind you I was baptized in Jesus name I tarried at the altar till the Holy Ghost came I am powered I am powered I'm carrying Fire! The favor of God is on me. Just speak a word, it will happen. I am blessed and highly. was a struggle preparing this word. I am blessed in spite
spite of my down setting. Minister Ward, you understand. In spite of the stuff that you want to happen that's not happening. You are blessed. Mm. The devil done all kind of stuff. And he thought you would have failed. But because you are blessed. And highly favored. I am blessed and highly favored. I am blessed. You are blessed. In spite of what is happening around you. In spite of the down setting. In spite of all the crazy stuff that is not that, that is happening. You were blessed and highly favored. Whatever it is that the devil is throwing at you, just remember you were blessed and highly favored. One more time. One more time, I am blessed. I am blessed and highly favored. And highly favored. a Come on, somebody open your mouth and say something in this house. Come on, worshipers, if you believe you're blessed and highly favored, let me hear you give God a worship. Come on, let me hear you give God a worship. Come on, let me hear you give God a worship. The biggest problem we have as believers is that we allow the devil to talk to us more than how God talked to us. And so even when you hear you're blessed and highly favored, the devil will want to tell you that you're not blessed because you're going through all kinds of hell. But can I just pinch you and tell you that the fact that you're breathing, you're blessed. Somebody didn't hear me. I said the fact that you're breathing, you are blessed. You are blessed. The devil would, have you, would wish to have you dead, but you're alive and well. You are blessed. Persons might wonder how is it that I often say this, who say this when I preach, but I believe it is my theme. The devil can't kill what God has anointed to live because I understand that this life that we are living, it's a battlefield. And so if, if, we don't, if we don't careful, the devil will try to wipe us out. But because we know we have a backative, we have a backative. We have a backative, and that is Jesus Christ. We are blessed and highly favored. Stand to your feet, everybody. I'm closing. I'm closing. We are blessed. And highly favored. There are some requests. There are some requests. Request. 
trying to find where do I put it? Yeah. We're going to pray because we believe that when the church prayed and something happened, is that an amen? amen. Is that an amen? amen? And for all the persons who are online, I just want you to, to declare on your screen, I am blessed and highly favored. Write it on your screen. I am blessed and highly favored. And so if you're blessed and highly favored, then healing belongs to you. Come on, brother, and give me something on the keyboard. If you're blessed and highly favored, that simple means healing belongs to you. That simple means everything God has for you, everything that God has, it is for you. Because you are his child, you are blessed and highly favored. And so if you're blessed, whatever the bad stuff you're going through, it's about to turn around. It's about to turn around. It's about to turn around. I'm believing God for some stuff, uh, Minister Ward, that they must come true. The devil will have us to be complaining and complaining and complaining. But guess what? We are blessed. We are blessed. And the highly favored. Hallelujah. And so those first online, this preacher just want to tell you, that in spite of what the devil want to tell you, you were blessed and highly favored. We're going to pray. We're going to pray. There's a prayer request for a Joseph Brown. A Joseph Brown. A Joseph Brown. He is in the hospital with a heart condition. We believe that there is no distance in prayer. There's no distance in prayer. And so we're going to put them before the Lord. Joseph Brown. There is another. I'm trying to find it. There is an Alfonso Reed. Alfonso Reed is in the hospital in Miami, Florida. And they're asking for, they're asking for our prayers. He's on a ventilator fighting for his life. We're believing God even now. We're believing God even now. I want the church to lift your faith with me. We're about to pray. Let's be prayerful at this time. Father, we come before your presence. We present Joseph Reed before you in the hospital with a heart condition. Thou who knowest all about me, stand by me in the midst of tribulation stand by me and so God even now Joseph Brown with a heart condition we speak to that heart even now we speak to that heart even now we declare healing in the name of Jesus we declare the favor of God to locate him even now we decree and declare it and he shall be healed by the power of the Holy Ghost Alphonse Reed who is fighting for his life on a ventilator machine the church stand in agreement right now this is serious time in church body of christ i want you to lift your faith with me these persons are depending on us they're depending on god and so right now i want everybody once you are able to focus just just try to be focused at this time as we tap in the spirit realm and we declare healing for these lives healing in the name of jesus we pray that the wind of God will touch over into Miami, Florida even now and, and touch Alphonse Reed. We declare that, that 
God, you are the great physician. You are the bomb in Gilead. And so right now we declare God that every condition, it is not of you. Sickness is not of you. And so God, we command it now to dry up oh, from the root. We declare God that they shall be healed. They shall be healed. They shall be healed by the power of Almighty God. They shall be healed by the power of Almighty God. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody shout the hallelujah. Come on, somebody shout the hallelujah. I am the Lord that healed thee. I am the Lord, your healer. I wish somebody would stop in the spirit. You sent your word and healed. Everybody out there on Facebook land. I am the Lord. Yeah. I feel this one. I feel this one. I feel this one. I feel this one. I am the Lord that He let thee. That He let thee. I am the Lord. Yeah. And heal. And heal your disease. I am the Lord. We're closing. Your but can somebody sing, I am the Lord? I am the Lord. That healeth thee. That healeth thee. Alfonso Reed. Joseph Lord. Brown. Send your word. I send my word and heal your disease. I am the Lord. I am the Lord. Oh. Your healer. Hold me right there. Hold me right there. As we're about to go, I want the church to help me do something. Because I'm believing God for these two persons, Minister Ward. I never had the experience, Sister Moy, of fighting for my life. But I can just imagine what it feels like to be fighting for your life. To be after placed on a machine. Oh, God. So even now I stand in this pulpit. I stand in the gap for Joseph Brown and Alfonso Reed. And we declare it that he healing land of the whole shall that he healing belongs to them.
set your word and heal my daisy. I, I don't know, but something just pulling on me. Something just pulling on me. And so wherever Joseph Reed is at this time, or whichever hospital he is in, I'm believing God for supernatural healing. Come on, church, you need to shout and say something. I'm believing God for supernatural healing. We're, we're believing God for, for a victory report. We're believing God for a victory report. A victory report. He shall not die. He shall not die. He shall not die. He shall not die. If he's not saved, God, give him a chance. 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 I beg on his behalf. 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 I beg. I beg. I beg on his behalf. I beg on his behalf. If, if he's not, if, if, if he's not saved, I beg God to heal him and shave him, God, for your kingdom. Joseph Reed, Joseph Brown, Alfonso Reed, be healed now. Those who are online, those who are online and you're going through sickness, this is for you likewise. Healing belongs to you. Healing belongs to you because you are blessed. And the highly favored. Come on, somebody shout a hallelujah in this house. Come on, somebody shout a hallelujah across this room. Come on, somebody shout a hallelujah across this room. Come on, somebody release a wave of hallelujah across this room. Come on, somebody release a wave of hallelujah across this room. Come on, give God a hallelujah in advance of your blessing. Give God a hallelujah in advance of your miracle. Give God a hallelujah in advance of your breakthrough. Come on, somebody shout the hallelujah. Those who are on the outside, shout the hallelujah. Let everything that have brother. Let everything that have brother. Let everything that have brother. Let everything.
inside. Just open your mouth for the last time and just shout the hallelujah and watch what God do. Somebody shout the hallelujah. 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 Shout, 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 shout. Shout, shout. Shout, shout, shout. Shout, 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 somebody shout, shout. Somebody shout, somebody shout. Release your sound, release your sound, release your sound, release your sound. Change and be broken, release your sound. Let it flow, let it flow, let it flow, let it flow, deliverance, healing, breakthrough, let it flow, somebody open your spirit. Just give a clap. And come, Minister One. Come to the very big shot. Somebody shout! Come, Minister Ward. Somebody shout! A dear, just fine person. Just open up your mouth and just shout. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Come on, come on, worship him, worship him. Hallelujah. God be the glory. Great things he has done. So love he the world that he gave us his son. Who healed his life and the atonement for sin. And open the life gaze. The life gaze is open, brethren. So all of us can go in. Hallelujah to God. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. It's all right, brethren. It's all right to worship him. It's all right to praise him. You have a reason to. You have a reason to give him thanks. You have a reason to shout unto God with the voice of archangels. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Just a few announcements. Please continue to call in to make your reservation for Sabbath service. You can go on our Facebook page and you'll see the, the updates and continue to support Sister Rose that ministry she feeds the the shut in and the less needy and also you can see sister colleen gilbert as she collect um or that fund i think that's it for announcement praise the name of jesus thank you minister chris you want to come pray god continue to bless you amen that his hands may continue to be upon you i'm blessed highly favored that's my new name for today. Bless, highly favor. Let us all stand for the last time while I pray this, put this blessing 
Amen. Praise the name of Jesus. The Lord bless thee and keep thee. The Lord make his face to shine upon thee. The Lord be gracious unto thee and give you his peace. But now and forever, in Jesus' name. Go with the blessing of the Lord. God bless you. Well, I was glad when they said unto me, let us turn this stream on and engage in an unforgettable worship experience. Come on, you know what I want you to do. I want you to like, share, and comment today. Come on. You make me happy. You make me whole. You take the pain away. I'm so in love with you. You make me happy. Say you may.